Well, this man keeps talking about being a has-been, but he's still in it. Mark, a bit scrappy, but you're into another quarter-final at the UK. <sighs> yeah, very scrappy. Um, I'm just over the moon to get through, really. You know, I could have possibly should have lost, but uh, I dug in there and, you know, I was having a lot of bad run going against me and just sat there and nothing to do about it, not stop mourning about it. And then when I had a little bit there, his, his swings in roundabout. So I was probably, well, I wouldn't say a little fortunate to get over the end, but uh, relieved. You both looked a bit nervous at times in that last frame. Yeah, I was cacking myself towards the end. I must admit, I was... I uh, really feel it out there, which surprised me a little bit. But, uh, yeah, I was cacking it. But that's unusual for you, because you're yeah, yeah. normally so relaxed around the table and you, you take the the luck and, and, and the bad balls in your stride, usually. Uh, yeah, well, I, I, I still took him in my stride, but I was just uh, twitching all over the place towards the end. Uh, you know, it's, it's nothing you can do about that. You can't, you can't teach it. You can't... You know, there's no way to stop... Uh, the nerves come in, they, they just come, and when they come, it's like, oh, my God, here you go. Well, you're still in it. You, you, you've got Ronnie. Before we talk about that match, are you surprised that the likes of yourself and Ronnie and John Higgins into your early 40s are still getting to the business end of these tournaments? Would you have expected, by the age you are now, for your generation to have begun being replaced by some younger kids in, in their 20s coming through? Um, y yeah, yeah. Um... I, I think we probably should have been replaced by the youngsters, but uh, you know it just goes to what I, I, I've always been saying that, that the standard has not gone up. Uh, a lot of people are saying the standard is this, that, and the other, but for me, it's, it's not gone up. I mean, we shouldn't really be well, not so much myself, but it's John and Ronnie mainly. But you know, they're still the two best players in the world, and they were probably two of the best players in the world 15, 16 years ago, and, and they still are now. Well, and, and you're not bad either. So what do you make of this uh, contest? It, it's, it's a great one for the neutral. It will be packed out. There'll be a brilliant atmosphere. You and Ronnie going ding-dong, head-to-head once again for a place in the semis. I guess the match tomorrow is one of the reasons why you still play snooker. Yeah, it's going to be a you know fantastic occasion. we packed house and uh, I'll probably have four or five wanting me to win the rest on his side. But <laughs> I don't mind the stuff like that. I just, I just hope they get... At these table eat to sort it because you know they 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 can't leave them like that. And uh, are we sticking with the Welsh has been? You can say whatever you want. I don't give a monkeys. <laughs> How about that? That'll do. I'll come up with something cheesy, no doubt. Good luck yeah, against you Ronnie. You can pick my walk on table if you want as well. And don't <laughs> don't tell me what it is till I come out. Thank okay. You. I'll all right then. I'll do my best. What am I? Whatever you want. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers.